Hello everybody, what's going on? I'm back again for another daily video and I hope you enjoyed the, the one yesterday. Um, tell me what you like and dislike about it um, down below in the comments because I'd love to hear so I can you know, improve this for you because you know, you're going to get some benefit from this so you may as well let me know what you want. So I thought the topic of today's video could be on cycling and getting outdoors, doing exercise, cardio, if you may. Because I was cycling down here yesterday to record my first video and I was like, damn, some people are missing out on this because I was having a great time just cycling. Um, you know, all those guys who are locked up indoors in the gym on the stationary bike, they're missing out on, on so much because the world's a big, wonderful place and if you're always in the gym locked up you're never gonna you're never gonna experience it um as much as you could so that would be a shame i'd say so yeah i know um summer has arrived and um, hopefully for everyone here um for everyone in the northern hemisphere um Southern Hemisphere guys, um, sorry, Nate Smith, but um, yeah, up here though it's it's getting warm. So my th my thought process is why not get outside and um, do your cardio? And um, don't get me wrong, you know I get um, if you're at the gym, it's convenient for you to do extra to go on the bike. Um, you may be tired, you may not want to go outside. Um, I get all that. Don't get me wrong, but. You know, if the if the circumstances are right and um, you can afford to do it, go outside. You know, get, buy a bike if you can't afford one. Borrow a bike from a friend and um, get something cheap off um, Craigslist. You know, uh, we're not trying to become Lance Armstrong here, um, guys. We're just we're just doing what needs to be done and what should be done, I guess. Um, so you know, there's so. Um, when I'm cycling, um, call me crazy, but I always see a lot of cool stuff. And um, you know, I'm gonna go out on a limb here and say, if you go for a cycle for 30 minutes, 45 minutes, 15 minutes, you're gonna see one thing that's cool. Now, you may be sitting there going, "What is this guy on about?" But you know, you're gonna you're gonna see something. You're gonna stop, and. Um, for a brief moment you're going to say, wow, that was actually kind of cool. It may be, you know, um, a squirrel eating a nut. <laughs> it may be um, an elderly couple sharing a warm embrace. <laughs> um, it could be anything, honestly. And, you know, you probably wouldn't see that in the gym. You know, you might see a bunch of um, sweaty guys and gals pumping iron. Sure, that's great, but... Um, you gotta get outside, you gotta um, experience stuff. I mean, it's a beautiful day today. Um, there's no better feeling than um, having the wind in your face, sun beaming down, and you don't have to follow an exact route, guys. Sometimes I just like to cycle aimlessly. I'll go until I, I'll cycle somewhere until I get tired and I'll just go back. I mean, you could have a destination in mind. You could cycle there, cycle back, or you could just set a timer keep going for 30 minutes once it goes off you just head home okay and I know some of you guys are gonna be like oh well how much um, how will I know how many calories I burn you know uh, but really if you're cycling for the with the same intensity and for the same duration um, you know you're gonna burn a similar amount of calories it may not be exactly the same but you know Unless you're competing in a fitness competition or you've got a photo shoot you've got to be like dialed in for or you're you know a professional athlete which if you're watching this um, I'm honored but <laughs> um, you know it doesn't have to be exact and it really won't matter in the long term guys and the benefits you get from being outside in the open air um, in my opinion far away the what you may not get from accuracy because at the end of the day guys calories are not everything and um, you know we got to experience the outdoors because they're they're a gift you know mother nature 
piece <laughs> but yeah and um, you know I get it if you live in a dangerous area or it may not be safe to go outside and cycle um, you know it might be really busy um, you know don't get me wrong go to the gym and cycle like <laughs> I don't want any mums knocking on my door saying you told my son to um, to go outside and cycle and now something bad happened to him so I don't want that so <laughs> You know, use your head, guys. Think and um, be. Have some common sense, right? If the shoe fits, do it. And don't forget to wear, you know, luminous clothing. Um, don't forget to put lights in your bike. You know, all that good stuff, guys. Because you can't rise and claim if you're if you're injured. So you gotta look after your bodies, right? You know what I'm saying? So, and even if you don't like cycling, I'd recommend trying it, go for a walk, just like I'm doing here. And by the way, I'd rather be, um, I'd rather be cycling while doing this, but you know, that wouldn't be, that wouldn't be logical or safe. So I'm walking just for you guys. So you should be grateful because I'd rather be on a bike cruising down, cruising down the street. So, and if you're if you're um if you're watching this right now saying who needs cardio cardio's for um wimps or whatever um you know you got to get over that um you got to get over that dogmatic thinking you know um in the og bodybuilding.com forums where people say that cardio's cardio kills your gains it's not true guys cardio improves your gains it um, allows you to go for longer and harder it improves recovery times and you know we as human beings we run on oxygen um, you know if you do cardio you get fit you're gonna improve your blood flow you're gonna improve um, your body's ability to carry oxygen and um, you're just gonna give your heart um, you're gonna give it an easier time so you know show some love to the heart um, give it a give it a little rest and it'll thank you for it okay so um you know everyone should be doing cardio if, if you can i mean um it's most people i think most experts would agree it's part of a healthy balanced exercise regime so just because you're a power lifter um, doesn't mean you sh shouldn't be doing cardio um you know everyone can do a little bit of something even if even if you're a busy guy and you work all day and um, you know I get that, so sorry, there's just some firefighters over there. Um, but um, yeah, if you've been sitting for six for six six hours straight, hunched over, you know, if you get a 15 minute, 30 minute break, um, you know, I know the temptations there to sit in the cafeteria and um, go on Facebook. Um, believe me, I've been there, but. Try to resist temptation, go outside, um, go for a walk. You know, your body's gonna thank you for it. You'll probably, f you'll feel a lot better um, in the long term. And yeah, guys, I thought I would just um, expand on why I think exercise is important outside, most notably cycling, because I cycle down here and you know, don't moral of the story is um, you know if you can get out of the gym because there's a lot more happening than than just the gym guys so go outside get some fresh air get some vitamin D get your heart pumping get a get a sweat on because um, it's a great feeling and I'll talk to you guys next time so hope you hope you enjoyed the video and don't forget to like comment Subscribe, share, all those, all that good stuff, and holla back at your boy. Peace.